Having, uh, having said as clearly as possible that the anti-vax people seem to be the winners, I want you to hear that clearly. The anti-vax people appear to be the winners. The anti-vaxxers clearly are the winners at this point, and I think it'll probably stay that way. And, and I don't want to put any shade on that whatsoever. They came out the best. They, they have the winning position. The unvaccinated have a current advantage because they, they feel better. The, the thing they're not worrying about is what I have to worry about, which is, I wonder if that vaccination five years from now... Because really, the anti-vaxxers, I think, were really just distrustful of big companies and big government. That's never wrong. It's never wrong to distrust government. It's never wrong to distrust big companies. So if you just took the position, let's just distrust everything the government did, well, you won. You won. (laughs) You won completely. I did not end up in the right place. Agree? You would all agree with that, right? I did not end up in the right place. The right place would be natural immunity, no, no vaccination. You should take victory, and I should take defeat. We can agree on that, right? That, that my position is now the weakest, and, and your position has gone from the weakest to the strongest, and that we can just say that's true. The people who didn't get vaxxed are absolutely in the winning position. You win. You win. You are the winners. You are the winners. All right, let me say that part with no ambiguity. You won. You won. Uh, all, all of my fancy analytics got me to a bad place. All of your heuristics don't trust these guys, it's obvious. Totally work. 